Welcome to the MedKline family. We're really excited to help you on your quest to get a better night's sleep. We made this video as a personal guide to ensure you have the very best MedKline experience. In this video, we will provide you with tips for arm positioning so you can find what is most comfortable for you. First, it's important to note that it can take up to 30 nights for your body to adjust to the new sleep position created by MedKline. Depending on how you've been sleeping for the decades before MedKline, the adjustment might take as little as two to three nights or may take longer. During your adjustment period, it's important to experiment with arm positions, the insert pillow, and body pillow to find what works best for you. There are two primary ways you can position your downside arm within the shoulder relief wedge. You can extend your arm out onto the bed surface through the hole at the base of the wedge, or you can bend your arm so that your elbow rests on the mattress and your arm comes back up within the arm pocket with your hand cradling the body pillow. In the second position, your elbow and your arm provide a much better anchor to prevent you from sliding down at night. Since you've been sleeping your way for decades, you'll need to experiment with your arm positioning to find what works best for you, especially since shoulder injuries vary so greatly. Keep in mind that you can move the smaller insert pillow around in the arm pocket so it provides support for your shoulder, or you can move it out of the way entirely. Once you have found your preferred arm position, should you experience arm numbness or find yourself sliding down during the night, please keep in mind that it is very important that you start the night high enough on the wedge so that you don't feel any pressure in your armpit or downside arm. Starting from head to toe, when positioned properly, your downside arm should drop comfortably into the arm pocket so that there isn't any pressure on your armpit or underarm. It is very important that your arm fall naturally into the arm pocket without any pressure from the arm pocket itself or the smaller insert pillow, which you can easily move around in the arm pocket. Once your arm has dropped into the arm pocket and there's no pressure on your underarm, make note of where your hips are falling on the wedge. Are your hips on the bed or are your hips up on the wedge itself? If your hips are on the bed, that's great. This means your wedge fits your torso properly. If your hips are up onto the wedge, this may be the reason that you are sliding down, often causing arm numbness or arm discomfort, as your hips naturally want to find the bed surface during the night. If this is the case for you, please give us a call so that we can send you a wedge that will better fit your torso. We have a few different size options from our Acid Reflux product line that may work better for you. We offer free size exchanges so that you have the best MedKline product to help you sleep better. Our final positioning tip involves experimentation with a therapeutic body pillow. Pull the body pillow snug to your neck and exaggerate your knee bend. Then, pull the body pillow between your knees or upper thighs. This position should help anchor you at night to prevent sliding. If you need to adjust the stuffing height between your knees, either higher or lower, you can pull the shredded memory foam stuffing apart to create a nest for your knees or add more support where you need it. You can also make similar adjustments for your head and neck. If the stuffing loses its shape over time, simply fluff and shake vigorously and the body pillow will regain its fluffiness. We certainly hope that these tips will help you adjust to MedKline. Remember that experimentation with both arm positions, the smaller insert pillow, and the body pillow are key to discovering sleep, glorious sleep. If you'd like more personalized suggestions, or if you have any other questions, please give us a call at 1-800-610-1607. We are here to help.